In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to fix the common CS2 trading errors that result in your Steam inventory being unavailable. We'll walk through this process step by step, aiming to resolve the issue in just 5 minutes. Firstly, let's ensure you're logged out of Steam properly. Sometimes just exiting the application can reset any stuck processes or connections that could be causing the error. To do this, click on the Steam menu at the top of your app and choose Exit. Alternatively, if you prefer a quick approach, you can right click on the Steam icon in your taskbar and select Exit directly from there. This guarantees that Steam is fully shut down, as some background processes occasionally linger and create issues. Once you've successfully exited Steam, go ahead and log back in. It's a simple step, but it can be surprisingly effective. Logging out and back into the service helps refresh your connection to Steam servers and may resolve any temporary glitches disrupting your inventory access. Next, it's important to check the status of Steam servers. This can be accomplished by visiting steamstats.com, where you can quickly determine if servers in your region are experiencing any downtime or issues. Sometimes, what seems like a personal error is actually a broader issue affecting many users. If the servers are indeed down, you might need a little patience until the service is fully restored. Additionally, it's worth noting that the Steam market and trading systems can experience slowdowns, especially during peak times or when there's a large influx of requests. This is not uncommon and often resolves itself relatively quickly. Keeping an eye on community forums or Steam's official social media channels can also offer insights when these issues are widespread. In summary, the key steps to resolve the CS2 trading errors in your Steam inventory involve exiting and restarting Steam to refresh your connection, verifying the status of Steam's servers through steamstats.com, and staying informed about any general service interruptions. By following these steps, most inventory errors can be quickly addressed, allowing you to get back to your gaming without significant delay. I hope this guide has been helpful for you today. If you encounter any persistent issues even after these steps, consider reaching out to Steam support for more personalised assistance. Thank you for watching and I wish you the best of luck with your Steam experience.